So, all right, let's get started here. So, first up, we got the J. Urban fake from the College Carball Spring Invitational. It's the final day of the final College Carball Spring Invitational, I think. Uh, so, you know, some decent stakes on this. I want to say there's a $250 prize for those, but I could totally be making that up. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about a prize. Kikabyte, do you know if uh, if there's a prize for these? I used Steam previously, but I just linked my Twitch and it took my one rep. Darn, lol. Uh, yeah, uh, that's gonna happen. <laughs> Not really much I can do about that. I don't know how to know that your Twitch and your Steam are from the same person. If you're really quite upset about it, actually, you know what? Yeah, Bears did what I was just about to do. That works. If we nay all of them, then Alec loses and chat wins. No, if you nay all of them, then I just pick which one my favorite is. And, you know, it's an awesome, fun, fun evening. Damn shitty watercolor has put out a shit ton of Rocket League related drawings. Yeah, he definitely has. No prize for the monthlies, just for the final. Oh, okay. Okay, now I understand what's going on here. So these are monthlies to qualify you for a final. Ah, uh, okay, so this is like Renegade Cup style, where this is a qualifier for a much bigger championship that will come later. Didn't actually care that much, and the prize is TBD from what I know. Okay, yeah, so j Bob Sand point system to qualify for finals. There we go. So, all right. Uh, so, yeah, uh, green team here down, or actually, no, he was on the white team, wasn't he? I forget. Uh, no, he's on the green team. He's over there. So, green team down a couple goals at halftime. And it looks like where they are up a game. So down a couple goals, but up a game. Here's this. It's vote one for Jay Urban's fake and block. Vote one for this one. Last game, so you're gonna have to come to us if you wanna if you wanna have anything work for you. Yeah, and one thing to note with the last game, it was a 5-0 scoreline. We see a fake for Jay Urban! Oh my oh, goodness! Wow! What a play. That was that was filthy right there. Somebody clipped that, send it into dailies as Jay Urban fakes oh. out. Oh, that was beautiful. And dunks pack to boot. So, wow. So that's vote one right there for the Jay Urban fake and block. I'm just going to add that on there. Then we got vote two here for Yo What The Fuck from uh, uh, the RL Premier Series. This is the uh, Velox, I think is, is was his full name. Velox... Uh, Ha -ha. Velox hops up to the ceiling and comes back down. It's going to be vote two for this one here. We're in the RL Premier Series. I'm uh, pretty sure this was a priceless 3v3. His team is up a couple games, but game three just getting started here. This is going to be vote two here. These here showing uh, from Boost Legacy as they're not, you know, doing all the freestyles and all that, but just doing the right mechanics in the right time. Oh my Woo! gosh, Velez! Forget about what I said. What is this? How does he make this touch? Oh, he comes off the ceiling. God. Are you kidding me? What? Okay. <laughs> uh, so that's vote two for Velaz there. Not Velax. Velaz. Uh, vote two for Velaz there. Vote two for that one. We got vote three here for Dapper and uh, Garrett's into. Big old double touch. This is going to be vote three for this one. Vote three for this one. Also, I'm jealous, Manhattan. Meatball subs are awesome. So, yeah. Vote three for this one here. Yeah, they had, like... <laughs> oh, God. Arsenal is funny. Legends and Arsenal side-by-side -side with Rapid. Wait. Oh! <laughs> I saw it happening too. I saw you come off the ceiling. Yeah, they're like, <laughs> oh god. It sounds like he's in comms with Rapid. That's kind of weird. But uh, yeah, so that's vote three for that one there. Vote three for that one. And then last up, we got vote four for. Uh, who actually was in this play? Crypto 4. Um, big ceiling shot. 
This is gonna be vote four for this one here. Vote four for this one. So yeah, then that's vote four for that one there. Vote four for that one. People like the ceiling reset today. That's three of four. Uh, yeah, I mean, there weren't really any good team plays. And there weren't any interesting flip resets. But there were three interesting ceiling shots. You say people. I mean, I, I was pretty much the only one who voted in round one. So it was mostly what I liked that made it into round one. And then of what I liked, people here in chat like the ceiling shots, I guess. But, uh, yeah, you're not wrong, J-Bob. Man, saying all these plays are like 5 out of 10s. Yeah, but, you know, that's what we got today. Which one is the better 5? Yeah, exactly. Which one's the 5 point something? Uh, a couple of you guys said some things. Caspadon said, nay, too. It's a bad clear, and Vels just had to, just had some game sense to come up. Keek saying, I really think that 3 required the most skill, including the reaction to the bump and the aerial control. Shots is saying, I thought that too, until I saw he was already facing the right way to land on the ceiling. Uh, and the Garrett thing is the best thing about the clip. The rest is already kind of meh. Uh, and Shots is saying, <laughs> Shots is doing vote five. Apparently none of them are fives. Nope, none of them are fives, Shots in. So, all right, so yeah, we got Jay Urban's fake and block. Velaz uh, kind of, you know, going up to the ceiling, coming back down on that bad clear from peak. Dapper getting bumped up to the ceiling and coming down for a big old double touch. And then Crypto getting that huge double touch off the corner. Uh, I guess Manhattan's vote on four is, what making, is what's making the yellow bar so big. But Dapper's play actually has three votes to Crypto's two. So let's just deal with these two first and then we can talk about these two. So anyone want to argue Jay Urban here is the best play of the day? Anyone want to drop a vote one on it? before I kill it and, you know, we move on with our lives. J-Bob saying kill one pretty easily, in my opinion. Manhattan saying I do think one and two are clearly the worst. Fabunalists. Indeed, Shutson, indeed. Castletana also saying one and two are the worst. Kikabut saying as much as I wish I could because I was casting it, the others were better. Kill one. So, uh, yeah. Alright, let's get one out of there. And then same question on two here. Anyone a huge fan of this one want to argue that it needs to stay around, that we desperately need it in contention because it's at least as good as the other two, or are we still all good with killing this one? I mean, Caspatan already said to kill it. Manhattan already said to kill it. Uh, were those the only two who said that? I thought there was a third person who said kill one and two. But yeah, Kikabite saying kill. Shutson saying, I don't look when I type, so I must have misaligned, if that makes sense. But you got Nalis correct. You accidentally added an Uba in place of the I. That was your typo. You, you instead of I, you typed Uba. <laughs> I don't think that's misaligned. Ah! Jimblade, speaking of misaligned, what's up, man? Good to see you. And Rizex, good to see you as well. Just rat that tat out of this shit. Yeah, of course you're saying kill it. I don't care what you think, sure. U is next to I and B is next to N, but then you still typed the N. That's the thing. It's, you, it's the U-B-A. You typed instead of the I. You know, see what I'm saying? You typed F no lists with an Uba in there. So for some reason you went F Uba <laughs> no lists. <laughs> I'm not buying it. Uh, Shutson. Do you know the alphabet? <laughs> Promise me better. Good. That's all we wanted from you, Shutson. So, uh, the only thing I feel is all the ladies with this D. Nice, Chim. Uh, and yes, I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna I like play Oreos these two again. And pussy. Yes, in that order. <laughs> What's up, Nova? How you doing? So yeah, alright. Let's get Velaz out of there. And that means it is now... 
down to, oh my god, how am I so bad at clicking that big red button? Whoops. Fuck, did I just eliminate Garrett? Come on, don't go away, don't go away, don't go away. Motherfucker. What's up, Novacore, by the way? Okay, cool. So that one's back. Uh, I guess they're all at ceiling reset doubles. Yeah, a little bit. Uh, is that Bo Burnham? Yeah, it is. Uh, did you see my shot? If you submitted it, then yes, but I don't remember it. Sorry. You can maybe try to jog my memory a little bit, but uh, uh, it doesn't seem to have made it to the final round. Sorry, man. I'm <laughs> just too paying better. Uh, like, why don't you tell Chinblade off? He is clearly not allowed. What? What are you talking about? Chinblade? I don't even know where you're coming from. Uh, Niptrax, to say that? If you say so. Why don't you tell him off yourself? On stream as a mod. What? What did he even? I don't even know what, what Niptrax is like jokingly getting mad about. Uh, I clicked the edit tight device. Oh, yeah, it does that sometimes. Uh, I don't know why. I honest, There's, like, certain parts of the, the, the box where if you click it, instead of, like, doing that, it just, like, takes you... Yeah, see? Take over here. I'm kicking you out, Shutson. There. Now you're not in my database anymore. That's not even the database. That's just the WordPress backend. Uh, you, you cannot ban moderator Niptrox unless you're the owner of the channel. One day you'll fix this bug. Yeah, probably not. Stocky added me on Twitter. I mean, uh, yeah, then I saw it. That doesn't actually help me remember it at all, but I did see it then, yes. I uh, missed most of the stream because I was donating blood plasma. Oh, look at me. I'm such a good guy. I help people not die. Fuck off, Novacore. You're not better than me. <laughs> yes, I was donating urine. Wacon's better than me. If he was donating urine, that's that's an honorable man right there. So you might have a hole in your stuff. No, I mean, it's not a hole. There's really no, I mean, you can do some shit back there, but you can only do it because you're a mod anyways. So, you know, I, I roughly trust you guys. Uh, it's just a weird thing where for some reason the JavaScript listener only covers a certain part of the th one thing, but not the other thing. I don't know, to be honest, it doesn't make much sense to me, but I haven't really looked into it at all. Uh, joke's on you, bitch. I get paid for this. Ah, there we go. It's not really donating then, that's selling. That's not, donating implies you're not getting paid for it. You didn't donate blood plasma, you sold blood plasma. Uh, nobody would want my blood, yeah, me either. It's here at the start because I'm letting people die without my blood. See, there you go, Caspatan. That's, that's what a real man does. Doesn't like save people, help people, make the world a better place. No, a real man watches people die knowing he could help them and feels nothing. That's what it means to be a man. It's donating. I'm not being paid. I'd have to claim it on my taxes if I was. Uh, I think you could get away with not reporting that. Anyways, alright, let's take a look at these two plays we have left here and, and see what people think of them. The moment the voting is pretty split, we got Manhattan kind of carrying play number four here to get it up to 101 points, but only two actual votes on it, whereas this one over here has three votes uh, that get it up to 47 points. So like I said, voting pretty split. Play split. So let's see if anyone wants to add some votes and, and shake something loose here. So first one is number three for Dapper here. This is vote three for this one. Yeah, they had like, <laughs> oh God. Arsenal is funny. Legends and Arsenal side by side with Rapid. Wait. Oh! <laughs> I saw it happening too. I saw you come off the ceiling. So there's number three for Dapper, and here's number four for Crypto. I'm just gonna leave this one muted because everyone hates the music so much.
So yeah, then that one's four right there. So how you guys feeling? Anyone want to put some more votes in? Someone just dropped a vote three. Shuts in? Shuts in went on three or four as well. Okay. Um, what we got here? Yeah, so Shuts in went vote four. Uh, Keeg is saying, yeah, add the save and clear on top. And I still think that three is the best. There was a save and clear on three? Yeah, they had like... <laughs> Oh god. Arsenal is funny. Uh, Legends and uh, Arsenal uh, side by I mean, yeah, it's a nice little counterattack. I guess I guess the, the quickness of the transition is actually moderately impressive. I, I don't think the save and clear is particularly impressive, but I see what you're going for that that's a really snappy counterattack. He gets right on offense and you know. I don't know. My main objection to this one is he has so much time to recover from that bump that it's not actually that impressive. Uh, and then, you know, it's as simple as double touches come to get that actual goal on that empty net over there. Uh, wake on saying that's unfair. The audio is part of the play. Uh, I think it'll set the tone of the play better. It won't. Cast saying, to be honest, 4 is better because it even has an edit. Frame my vote better. Shuts saying, yeah, the Garrett thing was the only thing doing it for me on three, and now I see that it kind of happened to him rather than anything great he did. I'm just not into it. Yeah. Exactly, right? Like, he doesn't have to adjust or anything to get that landing on the ceiling. He just gets bumped <laughs> straight up into the ceiling, and then it's, you know, a really basic ceiling shot from there. So, my, I don't know. I mean, you know, to be fair, though, what happens on four? Four is just a less basic ceiling shot, right? That's what we're dealing with here. Like, basically, the angle is nicer on four. It's honestly really hard to tell these plays apart. In three, Dapper gets bumped up to the ceiling and hits a, a weaker ceiling shot. In four, he doesn't get bumped up to the ceiling, but he hits a slightly nicer ceiling shot. That's that's basically the distinction we're working with today. You'll probably get more rep by just not mentioning it all the time. If only that were true. People are suckers for giving people rep when they ask for it. What is this music? Weeaboo? Uh, it's called Muy Tranquilo from Grammatic. I don't know where you're getting Weeaboo from. Nova saying vote three. All right. Wake on also going for three. All right, we got a tie here now. Cool, so you're saying I think the three is more impressive than four because you can't practice getting bumped, really. Four is something one can do over and over again in training until they get it right. Three requires at least some adaptability. I mean, okay, but like Shutson was saying, he didn't do anything to get bumped correctly. He just got bumped in such a way that it didn't actually fuck him up at all. And then it's a really easy ceiling shot from there. j saying, I think it's a nicer angle, but worse shot on four. That's kind of true. The mods are not even close to my giveable reps, all right? Uh, do. What's up, Hibs? How you doing? I'm pretty good. Where's my old message? I need to copy and paste it, yeah. Yeah, the carrot thing was the only thing doing it for me on three, and now I see that it kind of happened to him rather than anything great he did. I'm just not into it. And Wake on saying, yeah, him getting bumped puts three above four for me, blatantly ignoring Shutson's message right above him. Nova saying bump recovery is strong, though. No, it's not. <laughs> There's no bump recovery in this. I'm sorry. He gets bumped, happens to land on the ceiling, and then he's just like, oh, okay, well, I'll hit a ceiling shot then. Oh, I'm not really feeling this at all. j I'm saying, yeah, the main difference is in that in four, he had all the time to set it up. He had all the time to set this one up! They're exactly the same play. There's no discernible difference between them. The only difference is Dapper's not going to give a shit about winning, and Crypto 4 will. That's the only argument I could see at this point for one play over the other. Otherwise, they are exactly the same play. He didn't recover from that bump, though. He just got hit into place. Yeah, and then had plenty of time 
to get back to the ball. Like, there's really, the bump adds nothing to this play, honestly. Cassie's on saying four look cleaner, though. Uh, yeah, this is what we're left with, Hibbs. It's a pretty slow day today. Cassie's on saying three is all luck, no skill, just some bronze playing. Make pairs a mod because Niptrox is flaming him? Maybe. Play with audio. Let's see if they're the same. All right, let's see if, yeah. Let's see if the audio changes anybody's mind. Why not? Here's four with sound. Oh, wait, why? Dance with the devil in the boy. Made sharks in the water, but it's all the same. I'll be holding on. No, you can't. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit! Oh. Take that music right there. Beautiful song. Everybody loves that song. I know it. I know everybody loves that song. Anyways, J Bob saying Dapper still was really quick to get up to the touch before the bump. I'm fine with splitting or giving to four. Hib saying Dapper's goal is more so adapting <laughs> rather than recovering from the bump. I guess that's fair. I, I mean, I feel like even adapting is too strong. It's sort of more like, uh, you know, overcoming <laughs> maybe feels good or like, you know, uh, resisting. Dapper resisted the bump. I, I don't know. Even adapting gives him too much credit in my mind. Man saying the shot itself in number four is cooler. Uh... Cool, so he was saying, yeah, he got bumped into the ceiling, but it wasn't planned. He didn't plan to hit a ceiling shot. He got bumped into the ceiling and then did what he could with what he was forced into afterwards. Am I watching a different <laughs> fucking play from some of you guys? Is there another play? Like, I hit this, and then someone's hacking the feed, and a different play comes in where Dapper has to, like, really quickly do all kinds of rotating and adjusting to deal with this bump? Or are we watching the same fucking play, and the bump is absolutely irrelevant to it? That literally, oh, he didn't plan, he got bumped to the ceiling and then did what he could with what he was forced into afterwards. Like, legitimately, it made, it made no difference to him that he got bumped here. If he doesn't get bumped, he just sort of aerials into this ball instead of aerialing into this ball. There is no effect of this bump on this play. Like, look, his plan... Right here, let's imagine Rapid isn't here. His plan is to push this ball down the field and then get the rebound and hit it in. Right? That's his plan. And then Rapid, Rapid bumps and he's like, oh, I'm slightly higher than I was before. Oh, well, I'll just aerial over to this ball and get the rebound and hit it in. That, the bump makes no discernible difference on this play. You see, 4 is better. New leak music from new Rocket League update. Uh, cool, so you're saying I'm tempted to switch to voting 4 just for the music. Uh, that's the call, says Wacon. I uh, just see Alec dancing to no sound, and it's pretty funny. Nice. Dapper found himself on the ceiling and went from there. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, God, it's so nice when you agree with Alec. You just sit back and let him ramp for you. Yep. What's this one? Is this one of the Garrett's? Final minute. This was the scoreline in game three. <laughs> Cloud nine. Unable to take it, but Squishy now with a daily shot, he puts it through! He's been going for this stuff all season, and he pulls it off here in the most clutch moments. The player to invent the shot himself is able to get the delayed front flip and just destroy Method on defense even- I remember that. Uh, anyways, uh, I know it's hard being so wise, but someone has to take the hit. Uh, I just want to see some ground play with a shitty flick. What do you see? Uh, cool, so Sam vote 4 for the music, to be honest at this point, because the plays are practically the same, that arguing for one over the other is hard. Nova saying, I say 3, because Dap used literally all of his boosts to make the play. Tight tolerance. Alright. Uh, like, on sometimes I don't know whether I should worship you or condemn you. Manhattan saying, I worship Waycon. Definitely the safer choice. So, yeah, we seem to be pretty split on this one. Does anyone at all feel strongly? Does anyone at all feel like one of these plays is much better than the other one? I mean, I feel like we've pretty much agreed they're exactly the same. Uh, okay, now a lot of support fleeing the dapper play. Uh, Wake on a Coolsios hopping on number four. So now it's looking like we should just give it to number four. 
a specifically sexual manner. Shuts and saying no, not at all. Wake on saying I don't care. Shuts and Nang, both of them. Uh, Wake on saying I liked your argument earlier. The Tapper won't give a shit, but the other guy will. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I think that's the most compelling argument at this point. They're the same play, but Dapper won't give a shit if he wins. And Crypto will, will, you know, be super happy and proud. So fuck it. Let's just give it all to, to Crypto. Uh, Kiga. Is that J-Bob? Yeah, Kiga, J-Bob, Novacore. You guys got a problem with that? You guys got a problem with giving it to Crypto because he'll actually appreciate it. And Dapper will just be like, oh, sweet. Cool. Uh, Manhattan saying he ends number four with no boost as well, Nova. That was a stupid argument. Uh, Kaspertan saying four is much better. Intensive gameplay, intense, intense music, intense gameplay, intense editing. Nova saying they're the same play, but I like Dan Dapper's angle better. All right, well, Kiga's abandoned you, and J-Bob, I think, has left. So I'm going to ask you to, to just sort of, uh, you know, stand down, I guess, Novacore, and, and uh, you know, concede that, that Crypto seems to have won the chat over with his amazing gameplay and lack of being a famous Rocket League player. Before again, because the music is too good, says Coolzios. Uh, Shuts is saying we should have done that for the Justin goal. Justin didn't care, should have given it to the small time streamer. In fact, seems like a good policy moving forward. Which Justin goal are you talking about? The one yesterday where it was Scrub Killer was the small time streamer? Is that the joke you're making, Shutson? No, I was saying I'm going to throw Oreos at you until you all agree with me. I mean, I'm down with that. You can throw Oreos at me, that's fine. Kiga saying Dapper's play may have been better, but Crypto will appreciate it more. Ah, uh, that one shuts in. Yes. We should have given it to the small time streamer instead. Kill Novacore. I solved our problem. Seems like a good plan, Manhattan. No, I think I think I know, shuts in. I think I got you. Who won yesterday? Scrub and Justin. Scrub got the main prize, Justin got a junior prize. So, all right, Novacore, I'm taking it from your attitude that you are willing to accept that the will of the stream is to go with play number four, and I can bang this gavel. Last chance for anyone to object to that and say, no, for the love of God, please, no, don't give it to play number four. Three is so much better, but uh, yeah, I think we're good here. Crypto, if you're watching this, fix your music choice. Yes, everyone was quite offended by it. What? Potential future crypto. I check to the gavel, use your forehead. What? To be honest, it would probably make just as loud of a noise because my mic is like on my shirt right here, right? So if I like banged my head into the, the wood block, you know, the mic would probably pick that up just as well as it picks up the gaveling. Although I don't think I really have that kind of range of motion on my, on my hips, you know, but here. How was that for a gaveling? Did what? that, did that okay. effectively gavel? My buddy got me, who got me into Rocket League the first place before taking a massive break started playing again today and he goes, so, is Kronovi still good? I mean, to be fair, yes. Kronovi is still good at Rocket League. He could beat any of us in this chat. Uh, so yes, he is, he is, uh, you know, good at Rocket League. But uh, yeah, guy's a little bit out of date, I guess. No, try again, but gavel your face. I could probably make some good noise with that. Like if I gavel the cheek, like forehead. Yeah, that's not gonna. That's not picking up anything, but like, I'm not picking up anything either. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I think I'm just gonna do this. Meeting adjourned, motherfuckers. I said Google squishy muffins. Yeah, you can't beat me. All right, I'm just gonna agree with all you guys. You're goddamn right, Caspatine. You're goddamn right, Novacorp. With a 3DS controller. I wonder who the generally accepted best player is right now. Uh, yeah, we were having this conversation yesterday, actually. I was saying KDOP. Some people were saying Turbo. Uh, and then I think someone else was saying Violent Panda. But yeah, I, I definitely think it's KDOP. Alpha 5 Whore. <laughs> definitely wake on. Can't stop, won't stop. Exactly. I swear title on the stream is not changing as long as Satan is not here. Yeah, no, I don't really particularly care. I honestly don't think there are that many people browsing Twitch 
in the Rocket Daily in the Rocket League category who have scrolled down a little bit and see the Rocket Dailies and they're like, oh, round two. I would enter if it were round three, but I don't want to watch round two. I really don't think that's much of a thing, so it's really not something I give a shit about, but some of you guys are really obsessive about it. You expect us to do work, Nip. Yep. Uh, what's going on here? Get up, Shirley. Best all royal pirates. Obviously, shiest. <laughs> Obviously, Novacore. Obviously. Did you hear about this new pro? I think his name is Caspiton? No, I haven't. All I've heard, I know about this, um, I was reading this news story yesterday about this child rapist named Caspiton. Uh, that was, I, all I remember is he was this, like, really brutal child rapist. Uh, and, and, like, all the other child rapists, like, turned him in. Because they were just like, they were like, look, this guy is giving child rapists a bad name. We can't have him sullying, you know, our reputation. So all the other child rapists got together and turned Caspiton in to the police. The police were like, oh my god, we'll even, like, let you walk out of here. Because we're so happy to get this Caspiton guy. We'll give you all, like, immunity. So, yeah, that's that's the only Caspiton I know. Uh -huh. seen that vape tricks all playing? Nah. Kate Upper Fairy. Uh, I don't remember Kiga. A few people, I think. I already changed the command this week. Yeah, you did, Shutson. Don't, uh, don't strain yourself. Or Garrett. Yeah, Garrett would probably be in my top three. I don't know. He's just got to win a land. He's got to win a major besides X Games uh, before I'll actually put Garrett in my top three. But I wish I could put him in my top three. I think he belongs in the top three. He just, you know, can't win anything. Whichever response was right last year. Yeah, people don't really update their shit. I'm done until next Monday. Not politically correct, he's a child enthusiast. I mean, you're always welcome to update it, Nipchox, you know? Thank you for doing it just now. If it's like bugging you, go ahead and update it. You don't have to like get permission or anything. You've got a sword, so that's four. I think Scrub will be number one, but not quite yet. But I could see it going that way in the years to come. I could see that. It's not unreasonable. Scrub and Alpha probably the next in line. Okay, interesting. Alpha five four. <laughs> Garrett is also so cute. That has plus ten to skills for sure. So we found out Mystic was the reason when Mocket Esports lost the grand final to Northern Gaming back in season three because Scrub is smashing it. Man, I feel like there's a bunch of logical leaps in there that I'm not following. I remember Maka losing the grand final to Northern Gaming in Season 3. I don't know how you get Mystic and Scrub into the same conversation, though. Over Zero is still the best. He just needs to regrow his hair to reclaim his position as the Jesus of Rocket League. Yeah, well, then he's going to have to fight Fairy for it, too, so. Uh, no, we're done. Caspatan, we're giving it to uh, Crypto. Yeah, I forgot to actually officially declare that, but congratulations, Crypto. You are our winner for yesterday, for today. Man, that was a